Greetings everyone, welcome back to Riviera the Promised Land. I should explain something before we begin. I haven't noted it yet, but the last bit, it feels like we've been doing this area a few times. I know, I know that was probably because I made a mistake with the dragon and not performing the special, but I just feel the sections ran on a bit too long, personally. And I just feel... It would have been nicer during that fight up in um, the bottom left, top left, that place, yes. If there had been some indication to do a special, or if there had been like, the only way to finish this quickly is with some sort of super magical chocolate, kind of. But that's just bemoaning something, that was my own fault. But that's just, I feel, a little annoying because it, it felt like watching DBZ in many ways. It felt like I was watching ten episodes of me walking around in a circle fighting a dragon. But anyway, we're going to a courtyard, and there are purple things, and immediately I don't trust them, but we're going to look at them anyway, of course. And apparently this is the courtyard. Wait, is this the same courtyard we were in? Is that why it's funny? Yes, I did hear that, because it, it, it makes sense. It probably sounds like metal though, or something. Metal clanging. That's... was something... What? wait, what? I was meant to guess? Was that a game? That was... that's... Was, they're probably evil. But they're, but no, they're not. They're moon lilies. The moon gave them to us. They're not actually moon lilies in any way. They're probably from Shropshire or something. Or whatever the Riviera equivalent of Shropshire is. I bloom during the full moon. That's great. That's... Am I meant to give them a cuddle? Maybe they were just shy, maybe they were having trouble seeing eye to eye with the moon today. They're like, oh moon, what are you doing? In actual fact, why is there a moon? What is the moon in this world? Because it's not the Earth, we're not on the Earth. How are we seeing a moon? Is this a planet? Is Riviera a planet, or is it just like a giant square, like Bizarro World? I question that as well, Iron, but I've certainly learned that not to care. Apparently we look for clues, but we're gonna fight Scooby-Doo and... I'd say that's scrappy, but actual fact, considering I have seen the Scooby-Doo film, less tentacles, more abnormally crazy looking muscles. Of course we're gonna fight. Because fighting is all we know. That's all I've got. That's all we have left. Fighting. Cuddles are no longer an option in this world. Did I level up everyone? Yeah, yeah we did. Okay. Bring you, bring you, bring you, and bring you. Why not? Why not? Ooh, that different battle music. Oh, well, that's nice. That's handy dandy. No, way. no, I've heard this before. I just never heard the beginning bit. I'm too busy being so stupid. And we're going to try and get an S rank here, because getting S ranks nets us pancakes, or the TP equivalent of pancakes. I'm not sure what that's called. I'm not sure if there's an exchange rate for pancakes to TB. TB. I really hope there isn't an exchange rate for pancakes. What the hell? Fuck you, Guile. What are you doing sending out sonic booms made of sheet metal? I mean... I don't remember the guy ever doing a sonic boom and then what came out was like a bit of steel lining. Lining is probably not the correct one. Um, that's level two. We'll try white wave. White wave. Why doesn't it hit everyone? It's a wave. If it's gonna hit someone at the back, that would be nice if it hit them. Okay. That one well but didn't use to. Fair enough. Revenge Bite. That's quite a nice name though. Viper Rache. Viper Racket. I'm reading that as Rache. Oh, okay. Fair enough. That's not the people I want you to hit, but I'm not going to complain either. Ooh, that's nice. Just have to hope we survive this. Sonic Boom! That was mean. Oh yeah, because Tina... Tina's health is lower than everyone else's at the moment. Hit you with the thing. There we go. That's perfect. Hit him with an arrow. 
Uh, luckily they haven't used an ultimate thing yet, but apparently I'm just none of the shits. No hits, all of them doing nothing. Oh god, that hurts. Um, need to finish this really now, don't we? So we'll use an ultimate. Finish this off. Rizzo Luto, which is not to be confused with Rizzotto, which I may have said before, but to be honest, it sounds so said it makes me wonder. Anyway, deal with you, Dad. That's it. You're dead, son. You're dead, son. Oh, son. Son. I hardly knew. Now I get you. Not dead, but apparently nearly. Fine uh, Hydro. Fine I want to get some sort of fancy chocolate finish. Oh crap. It's. This isn't gonna end well. You a lady or a man? Do you have an under. Oh god, yeah, use it on the person who clearly. Oh, balls. That's. I. It's alright. I. I. That was a meany face who clearly. You know. That was, that was just me. Um, I'm gonna use a longbow because I want to finish this with a fancy super thing because I'm not sure how someone dying affects the score. I'm assuming in a non positive fashion. Assume because that's probably correct. Two damage. Well, feel proud. You did something before you went wherever it is you're going. Level one. Uh, level one. Um, just use the level two. Overskill breakouts because Tina's not probably a beard. Fuck, why do I keep forgetting that name? She's a good person, she doesn't deserve to have a name for that one. Triumph, we did it, we beat the people. Mean goblin face, man. Finish level 2. Obviously, we're gonna have a bad finish because one of our people. people fucking died! We did it. Are you two alright? You're the one who died! Why are you asking them that? Are you two? You're looking at Mother Teresa over here, sitting in the bed, you know, bleeding to death. Like, are you two alright? Yeah, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Are you alright? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I think this is a dead end. I think this is why I went in. There we go, let's have a look in the fountain. The water's so clear, I can see it to the bottom. We should give something. Scoop, nothing. Immerse. Why would I immerse the torch? Uh, let's try that. What is. What did that do? Fly by fire. Dangerous to be carrying. How's it. What? What do you mean? Considering. I, why we should. So we still have options, so we'll just scoop some. You'll have to make do. Item acquired. Water. This won't last. No. What? Scoop. I wait. Am I scooping more water? What is? What's happening? Um. Okay, we have to head back quickly, I guess. Are you all there, die? Oh dear. I'm gonna save her, of course I'm gonna save her. Down, right, up. Luckily that was good. Ah, oh, we did the say it nice thing. And she blushed, so hopefully crap. With do I do I have enough water? No? Okay, we'll have to go back and collect some. Mother effing fetch quests. I guess this is how life is now. Um, is this gonna happen every time? Because if it is, I might as well just rack up the love points every time. I mean, it's. Um, okay. Apparently, we have to do it again. I'm not even sure how he knows. It's like, let me get some more. Just some more food, water. Okay, this, are you going to say do it again? 
Um, how did you know it wasn't enough that time? Can we leave? Good, Lena. Thank you for listening to us. That's always good. Water. Book. Ignore them. Fucking flowers. Yay, we saved the moon. It's a moon drop. Alright, take it. Fair enough. Let's get some flowers. We saved the day. Blooming flowers. Sure. Just one. Fair enough. I guess we're gonna... Fucking ruin the flowers. I, I'm sorry, I'm a little lost for words, but we basically just said, oh, let's save those flowers. Let's fucking steal some flowers. I'm... Mm. So do we... Can we still investigate? I guess we'll drink it, because there's still an option to. It doesn't taste very good. Oh, thanks, Lena. That's great. I'm glad I didn't drink it. I'm glad that fucking idiot did. I do I'm doing things for you. Wait, what? Oh, okay. That didn't appear, I guess, until we drank it. Guess so? Okay. Quick time event? No? Item acquired. Black earring. What the hell? Black earring? Um... Uh, I'll get rid of you for now, but what the hell? We got a black earring because we want to be like some of the people in. Oh, hello. What was that? You said it twice. I think we pretty much know by now. We've got to save the day. Let's check the pillar first. <laughs> We're not really giving a shit. Like, oh, we should go up there and help. This pillar is very. There's something written here, that's great, I'm, that's some magic. It's a bunch of clovers and dandelions. Well, you could have a look, I guess. Four-leaf clover, it's rare, it allows you to prevent attacks from Warwick Davis dressed in bad makeup. Anyone who doesn't know what that means, thank fucking god. You don't know what that reference is, you're a lucky magic person. I'll give you a hug for it as well. Hardly ever. That would be why it's called rare. I loved. Um, right. Wait, you've only. I don't care how much you've already done with him. You've basically just gone on one trip to a castle. He stopped you from tripping up. Um, what? What? Yeah, I agree. It's become this now, I guess. Beers making her face. Because obviously they want to grope your cheeks, my friends. They want to give you a peck on the nose. Or whatever the one is. So everyone's just looking? So apparently they're happy because they. Oh, oh yeah, I guess we have to go investigate the fact someone needs help. What's happening? Uh, someone's fighting someone? Are we done with this game? Why is the fire back? Or whatever. The dude from before, but he looks long ahead. He, oh god. Is this one of those cases where I'm embarrassed enough to admit I... That's a very good androgynous look, but... No time to return to it, isn't that impolite? You're the one who did it, it's you. It'll be like taking candy. I'm guessing this is the stereotypical bastard of our piece. Oh, they screamed. Oh, oh, oh. I have little character aside from making you want to hate me. <laughs> You're alone, no one can save you now, your soul shall be mine. I won't lose to a filthy demon. You're making a very sweet face for someone who's just said, I'm not going to lose to a filthy demon. I'm guessing you're a lady, as befits the norm. Ooh, okay. 
we, is this just basically a, oh, okay, so I'm not doing anything. I thought, oh, you're putting me in a battle? I get to, no, okay. Your soul is as good as mine. Oh, okay. That's gonna hurt. So I guess this is the point where we step in. The end result is clear. Well, isn't that peachy? And uh, you just escaped somehow. Not explained. Just fair enough. You're here now. Well, all right. She, yeah, she. There we go. Love interest number three. Here we go. To this day. Well, fair enough. The dead need to know. Well, clearly, I've got. I uh, just. Okay. So, do Grim Angels just not talk to each other? It's like, oh, this person's pretty cocky. Oh, oh it's the lady we're fighting. Lady versus lady. I'm guessing it's the lady with a tragic past. That's usually the norm, isn't it? Obviously we're going to take Einhager to surprise and be like, What? You have a grim weapon? <laughs> what travesty is this? And let's bring in a normal ship. The hunt is on. That'd be a great, like, that'd be a great un opening line, I guess. Let's use a rapier. Obviously we're not going to be able to beat her because she's some sort of fixed boss, but eh, might as well try. That does damage. Seriously, not doing shit at all at the moment. Let's use Iron Hedge. Yeah. So now you gotta take note of the fact that just use the magical sword. I'll reap you. Well, that's delightful. Aren't you? Don't, you must make many friends. Though your attacks are pretty shit. I mean, what is obviously your superpower will be magical, but that's, that's a terribly poor performance so far. Okay, damage you some more. At what point are we gonna get to the point where I'm like, oh, uh, uh, rapier, guarded one, fair enough, do whatever you like. It's not like it matters, it's a fixed battle, I can tell because we're not doing shit to you. Um, Iron Jure, because I'd rather wait and try and perform something super magical. Um, we we'll use our super chocolate on her. I'm guessing because she's meant to be a tragic lady with a tragic backstory who's obviously doing evil for the wrong reasons and then we'll eventually we'll have to fight and who, when we fight her, will be like, I can't help you. I was meant to die. It's one of those stories. Like, um, who's the lady from? Fire Emblem 8, I can't remember. I have to play Fire Emblem 8 again, which won't be a terrible thing to do. Touche A, Touche A. Playtime's over. Who says that again? Playtime's over. Blue Sophia. That's fair. Um. Oh. A diviner. Okay, well I guess... You do realise that as a boss, even if you have infinite health, it's still not impressive when you pull out 3 and 4 HP moves. Diviner. That's good. Uh, apparently I was having a heart attack, but that's great. My diviner will be ready. Well, that's good. Send yourselves lucky. I could have done seven more HP of damage to you. <laughs> Sorry for the extra long episode today, but we got a bit done, so we might as well. Why are you all hanging around like the edges and stuff? Clearly just like when someone's sick, just fucking leave them in the center of a room and just do nothing. We were worried enough to stand staring at you from the edges, so we did that. My sword was shining. That's great. The next thing we knew, you were out cold, and your sword, if we can call it that, I sh its shape I would more define as Tetris-like in its complexity. That demon seems to recognize your sword. A diviner. 
that's what you call it. It sounds familiar, but unfortunately whenever I think of it, it gives me migraines the size of San Diego, whatever that is. Well, they're here, obviously, to give you all to recruit you into this love triangle and make it a square. That's not the We are here to find out about the Arcs. I guess you're right, but Serene the Ark. Chick with the axe is a good way of putting it. I hope some one of them. I hope she, like, she joins the party, because obviously she's either going to be the antagonist that you feel bad about killing in the end. Or, not her, I mean the other lady. She's either going to be a character who joins you after being convinced of the Magi's bastardness, or she's going to end up getting killed for her cause because obviously she's, you know, an evil with a tragic past. I'm sorry, I know this too much. What will become of Riviera? Uh, apparently. Your village is in Rosalina's forest. Well, I guess. Most people do live peaceful lives when they live on giant observatories. I don't care how lame that joke is, because I know no other fucking Rosalina off the top of my head, bar the one from Super Mario Galaxy. That's a really good game, I should play that. Destroyed him. Oh, isn't she a bastard? Stealing souls? How do you mean, stealing souls? Is she death? From Castlevania? As opposed to death from... The literary figure death because obviously I need to grow as a character and by doing that fall in love with you I do not know the drill We're fighting demons and I want to help fair enough my name's Ayn I am your love interest for this story unless it's one of the other two in which case that's gonna be a surprise turn Nice to meet you all. We got Serene, who has Hellsight. Um, which is the same weapon. Um, okay, fair enough, we'll just discard this one. Let's go. Wait, is that it? Can I leave? Can we leave now? Is that. Is that. No? Okay, let's, let's just go. Okay, deep within the- okay! Oh, okay, we're not even at the fucking end of the castle! That was... And Serene's joined us. So, we got a new character, where I think the ends, because the music's doing some magic. So we'll see you next time, for more Riviera, the Promised Land, where we have now gone from Sphere to Cuboid in Love Complexity. Ciao!